Investigators say the shooting happened after a driver armed with a knife tried to get on base. News 8's Amanda Shotsky is live at the gate where the shooting took place. The area is still covered in crime scene tape tonight. Amanda, what's the latest? Marcella, you can see that crime tape still here and all around the area. We've been seeing investigators coming through here for hours trying to figure out how a checkpoint stop turned into a fatal shooting. A crime scene inside the gates of Marine Corps Recruiting Depot. The yellow tape marking off where a person was shot and killed by guards at the military base near the San Diego airport. Officials say they were forced to open fire after a hostile driver tried to get onto the base. It happened just before noon today at gate number five, located on Washington Street. According to MCRD, a person driving this gray car tried to drive through a checkpoint. When guards asked the driver to stop, they say the driver got out of the car and came at them with a knife. Several warnings were given, but officials say that driver refused to comply. At least one gun was fired, taking down the person with the knife. Paramedics were called in, but ultimately pronounced the driver dead at the scene. The area was immediately roped off for further investigation. And since this happened on federal property, the Naval Criminal Investigative Service has taken over the incident. When asked about the identity of the driver who was shot and killed and whether they had any affiliation with the base, NCIS issued this statement. Out of respect for the ongoing investigative process, at this time we are not able to provide additional details. And I did speak to a spokesperson with MCRD. They said this type of investigation could take days to complete.